Today in this tutorial we will learn how to make a 2 to 4 decoder. So first of all we must have to learn what actually a decoder is. A decoder is a logical circuit which can decode n number of inputs into 2 raised to the power n number of outputs. One can or cannot say it is a selector but actually it is a type of selector which can select one output within many outputs. So first of all we will uh, make uh, this circuit, this logical circuit and then we will learn how to that how it used to perform all sort of its functionalities so take two not gates rotate them clockwise then here write active and get place four end gates also take this text right here is y0 increase its size it is y0 it's y1 y2 and y3 After we will complete it, then it's easy for us to understand this. So we can see four outputs and two inputs. Uh, write your A and B. A B Okay now we can say that we have four possible combinations if we have two bits two bits means if we have two inputs obviously we we just have four possible combinations that is two raised to the power n why it is so because we know that if we have two inputs that's a and b then outputs must be two raised to the power n a 2 raised to the power number of inputs so a 2 raised to the power 2 is 4 so for 2 inputs we must have 4 outputs a b 2 inputs y0 y1 y2 y3 4 outputs and we know that first combination for 2 inputs is 0 0 this is our like here you, you can you can write here as uh, table to table here okay and we know that in you, you can write here is a so it's, 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 it's must be a here here b 
So first is zero and zero. This is our first combination. So this is our first combination. Uh, zero and zero uh, can be considered as like after not get condition. Like uh, if if any any of these end gate is connected to after they these these not gates are on the outputs of these not gates we can say that they are actually representing zeros like uh, if a is connected to the first input and b is connected to the second input Th then you can see that we we, we connected y zeros both inputs to the output of this inverter not directly with a and b so so it is zero and zero then again go to text and write here as zero and one zero and one then a is zero so you can connect the second uh, and gate first input to the zero and b is one so for b you must have to connect it with yeah here okay then for two is completed for third and get uh, third possible combination is one zero we all know that one and one and zero One and zero so a is one and b is zero so we will connect uh, the first input to the a but if it is the a is one so you can connect it before and get rather than after so and b is zero so we can connect b after not get if it is y3 for y3 we we know that it is it, it, it will be the fourth the fourth combination and we all know that it is one one the last possible combination so so for the last and get it must be connected to the to the B uh, sorry no, not with B but with the uh, A here before not get and this one yes now we can see that the fourth end gate is connected to the before end gate rather than after so for a is one b is one so here now you are supposed to see the results okay so we, we can write here as toggle logic toggle
here here and one here so connect it with here and uh directly can be connected okay like this like this and okay also logic uh, probe must be there in order to see the result you can select the large version of logic pro in order to see the result Okay, now our circuit is complete. Now we will see the output. So as we know that for 0, 0, it selected the Y0 as output for 0, 1, that is A is equal to 0 and B is equal to 1, it selected the second for third that is one zero it selected the third and for fourth that's for one one it selected the y3 and what are actually y0 y1 y2 and y3 there are actually four outputs which can be controlled by two two input or decoded uh, input okay it is not just turning y3 on but also turning y2 y1 y0 is off so we must have to consider all these gates condition while placing or giving any sort of input so you can make your uh, what's called as uh, 2 to 4 decoder via this at this format okay so thanks for watching you can try uh, at your own okay thanks